pretty nice setup that we got this year. Um, we're fishing the Sheboygan Salmon Cup. We haven't fished this uh, first time was two years ago, um, and it was one of our favorite tournaments. So definitely wanted to come back. Um, this June time frame seems like a, a good mixed bag fishery. You catch kings, you catch lake trout, you catch coho. Um, and the port here is awesome. Fish this morning. Um, I think we had over 10 bites. Uh, kind of mix of cohos, uh, three adult kings, missed a few cohos. Okay. Alright, we're just getting uh, staged here for the 2023 Sheboygan Salmon Cup. Um, had a couple decent days of pre fishing, found a few fish. Um, I think we're going to switch our game plan up a little bit this morning, but um, we've got. Uh, Got a couple different ideas and we'll see if we get something to work here. Looks like a little bit overcast this morning. Hopefully I'll extend the morning white window a little bit and uh, just need five five fish per day. Tomorrow's looking iffy as far as weather goes, so need to have a good day on day one. Let's get to screaming kings. gonna get in that board. Okay, we got our first king on here. Um, set up in about 80 feet and started trolling. Um, in a due east. Um, got out to about 100. Water temp started to drop a little yep, bit. Yep, 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 yep. Walk back. Yeah, yeah, yeah! 
Pretty good splash back there, eh? Oh yeah. Had a little bit of a lull here. Um, probably an hour and a half lull actually. Had a landed about 10 pound king. Missed one while we were fighting that one, and then um, yeah, kind of bounced eh? around a little bit looking for some a little better water, and came back. And we're just outside where we had those bites this morning. And we just had another one rip. That's a, that's a 200 weight steel with a uh, green jeans, Lonnie Leprechaun fly. Got a nice king or something here. Not sure it was coming out of the water back there, but the way it was screaming and stuff. I think it's a king. Not a nice steely or something. Take that, take that. A good one. That's what we needed there. Thanks, Brady. It's like our high school. Their high school program sent so many people fucking all this year. Yeah. Top. Top. We got some dogs in the past now. Every time we saw it. Been getting lots of our hits. We just missed another another king bite. I'm out. 200. Now this is a 250. Blue jeans and a naughty lep. All naughty leprechaun flies. Green jeans and blue jeans. I've been happy with these boards. I've been happy with the change. That's Andy's right there. Thick sucker. Nice slab. He's probably, that's eight pounds. Oh yeah. You know? Yeah. It's thick. There we go, a couple kings in the, couple kings in the cooler.
I missed them. Holy shit, where's he going? Watch the rod. Right here, coming up. Yep. Sorry, Tornis. Nice, 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 <laughs> nice, nice. nice. <laughs> that was terrible. Oh. That was terrible. <laughs> oh. That was terrible. Oh. What was I doing? I got caught on the ladder. Oh. oh, man. Nice king, baby. We haven't had a bite in a couple hours now, probably. We had a little hot streak right around 8, 30, 9 o'clock. Just oh, back and that forth. thing wasn't even coming out, dude. Bouncing back and forth, the same, I don't know, quarter mile stretch, half mile stretch here. There's lots of bait, lots of fish marking. Just, hey, just hit 11 o'clock, so. Where's those players at? Put all my, all our confidence baits in the water, and we're gonna just pound this for the next hour, hour and 15 minutes, and just need one more bite. How's that? Dude, that's huge, bro. Job. Not me though. Oh. You, you look for a break, really. What you want is a, a, a decent surface temp like we, we got here and a you know, hold down temp. So just hold say that 46 down. jumped up to 50 right there. Yeah, but what you really, this is nice, but what you really want is to drop to 30 and it's 55 degrees. Right here, right here. Yeah, baby! Here. Take him, Torrin! Take him, Torrin! Stay calm. We just hit our fifth king. Well, seven kings, but we missed two. Here's our last one to uh, have a full box for the way in, and I'm, I'm a little nervous. Something there to look at those kings. Just a <laughs> peek, though. Just a peek. <laughs> Gotta get this sucker in. Is this the same diver? Yeah. Green jeans again. And this God. is his first fish with me thing since this is the started. first fish I've reeled in in two days. Yep. I've been handing him all the brat. He's been handing them all to me and his younger brother. <laughs> you have to drop that camera and help with those divers. Do so. Okay.
back up so that diver don't fall right down next to me. Ready? minutes efficient time here we're gonna pull pull lines in 15 20 minutes or so and um, we got five kings in the box we struggled for them it was tough we kind of just picked away at them during the day um, only had one bite in the morning uh, two bites lost one we had one other king bite we lost so we're five for seven right now but all kings um, decent average got one close to 20 pounder and a couple of the teens and then a few close to 10 12 so um, I think we got a pretty decent box going in. I feel pretty good about it. Um, just glad we were able to pick away at some and get a full box. Feels pretty good. We got five to weigh. Son. You gotta teach me. <laughs> we don't know anything. No, I don't know anything either. But you, you outweighed the scale. <sighs> now this is extra. Oh, bonus. I know. Nice. 5771. Sounds good. Nice. So just got wrapped up with the awards ceremony for the 2023 Sheboygan Salmon Cup. Um, we ended up uh, placing third in the Pro Division this year and uh, we got second in the, the side bet for the Pro Division. Um, only got to fish one day because of weather today, um, but we had a pretty good result, I'd say. I'm pretty happy with us, pretty proud of the guys. We um, had a pretty good pre-fish. We got down here Wednesday night, so we fished on Thursday morning and Thursday afternoon, and we did pretty well on Thursday. Um, just kind of going out there blind, we just uh, bounced around a little bit, kind of between that 80 to 130 range. Um, picked up a couple kings Thursday morning. Uh, fished about 10 miles south of that spot on Thursday afternoon and did really well. Um, I think we had seven kings on Thursday afternoon. Um, Friday we tried the same spot again. A um, little, less, little less success on Friday in the pre-fish but still found some fish. Um, but there's just lots of boats in that area so we kind of made a um, decision to um, go somewhere else on 
tournament morning, we, we ended up running about 10 miles north of where we were pre-fishing at. Um, just kind of got out in front of all the, all the boats and set up in about 85. Marked lots of bait, lots of kings right away. Kind of angled northeast out to about uh, 105, 110 feet of water. We started picking up fish just outside of that bait. So, um, trolled out a little bit deeper, didn't mark much, came back in and just and just worked it back and forth in that 100, 110 foot range all day, um, 110 to 120. Um, continued to mark bait, continued to mark fish, and we um, had good success. I mean, we, it was a tough day, but we ended up getting our five fish with about uh, 45 minutes remaining in the fishing period. We got our fifth one in the boat, fifth king, and um, couldn't be happier with it, really. We uh, um, had to make some adjustments. We um, changed some baits up. They are hitting kind of one particular thing. We did really well on uh, Naughty Leprechaun flies in particular. Pretty much every flash we had out had a Naughty Leprechaun fly on it, and they were going good. Um, Green Jeans Flasher was our best one um, on Saturday. Um, also took a couple hits on Blue Jeans. That one did pretty good as well, but um, both in that naughty leprechaun fly, so um, the fish kind of seemed to uh, be a little bit higher in the water column for us on Saturday. We were catching them down um, 60 feet mostly. Our 300 coppers were getting them good on on Thursday and Friday. Um, on uh, Saturday, we caught most of our fish on on 200s, 250s. Um, so just you know, up in that 40, 50 foot range was a little bit better for us, and um, moved our divers up a bit and ended up getting a few diver bites as well. So. Um, overall, just couldn't be happier with it. We had a great time, great weather. Um, had a good group of guys here fishing with me and um, couldn't be happier. So we'll be back next year and um, it's a great tournament, great place, great little town and um, couldn't be happier with our success this year. So.